If you beat Bowser, does the game stop or does it let you keep going? Uh, it lets you, it takes you back to the, the main world. Uh, dang it. New game plus. That's it. Game over. Uh, Good, I'm of. glad you didn't get that on your first try. <laughs>《ス e ーマリオ・ウォールド》、アンザック。And I'm Eli. And we are VTTV, and we are almost at the end here.、Uh, I know we've still got a bunch of star levels to do, and it, but it has been a minute since we played this game, so I don't remember what this castle is. And I don't know at all what I'm about to get into with the special level, so. Right. We're both clueless. <laughs> One well, of well, us is clueless. I've got a lot of、clueless. confidence. I've got a lot of confidence in you being able to figure it out. I think I remember. More than me. I think I remember this level being like more interesting and fun than the other moving track levels. Because, as a general rule, I'm not a fan of these because you have to spend so much time waiting. That was close. They're kind of fun on、um, Super Mario Maker. At least they can be. Yeah, that's just because players do a lot of cool, creative things. So,、um, funny story the other last Monday, when we went to your brother's house for DD,、mm -hmm. um, A lot of times when I show up at your brother's house, his kids are, are watching our channel、uh, <laughs> in the living room.、Mm -hmm. And when I showed up last week, they were watching、uh, Super Mario. And I said, you know, hey, that's cool. You're watching Mario. That's a, that's a fun game. And his oldest,、uh, Edmund,、mm -hmm. was like, yeah, but sometimes Mario doesn't make the jump. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. Yeah, sometimes he doesn't make the jump. It, it frustrates me too. Feeling a little called out. So, as far as I know, they're our most consistent and biggest fans, is,、uh, are my brother's kids. Oh, that wouldn't surprise me.、Uh, they really like the Zelda levels. So does, so does your brother. Your brother keeps saying, When are, when are you going to do another Link to the Past?、Uh, Eventually. Fortunately. They're not watching Dark Souls. I would, I would feel bad <laughs> if they were watching Dark Souls. Even though I censor it,、uh, it's still, still a little too much. Just a little bit. Just the young, for the young ones. And, and Isaac and Merrick, my, my slightly older, younger brothers.、Uh, have they ever played any of the Souls games?、Uh, I think Merrick has.、Um, I'm not sure about Isaac. If you had the cape, you could just. Yep, that'd be really that'd helpful. That'd be really easy. Don't、oh, know how you get that. Oh, shoot. Oh, you're about to run out yeah, of time. Nah, I got plenty of time. I still got 100 microseconds or whatever Nintendo officially calls it. Nanoseconds. Because it's not, not a full second. Do they have a name for it? I, I doubt they do, but in this, in this version era of, of Mario, there's. They're not quite a second. See, they're a little bit faster. Well, that's. I feel like that's the way all of them have been. Like, ever since Super Mario Bros.、Uh, I don't know. Maybe.、Um, nice. Easy, easy, nice. Easy game.、Uh, the boss. I do wish the boss design in this game was a little more interesting. They're all pretty simple and straightforward.、Uh, well, I feel like that's the first time you've done a jump and knock it. Down the tilted platform. Like, it's been a while since you've done one like that. A little bit, yeah. But there's really only like two types of bosses. And that's that, and then the, the sidewall crawl fall ones thing. Mario has defeated Larry Koopa in castle number seven. All that is left is Bowser's castle where Princess Toadstool is being held. Can Mario rescue her and restore peace to dinosaur land? I, I think we've mentioned this before, but I forgot that she was Princess Toadstool in this game. <laughs> yeah. So weird. There it is. All right. Well, only six more to go. Hopefully, this won't take four episodes. <laughs> Do I need to hit that? I don't remember. I'm gonna. I, I honestly really enjoy the saw. Like, these, I don't these think it matters. I think it does matter to an extent, but not, not much. Don't kill yourself. Ah,、right. well. <laughs> Made it further、Maybe、than、we'll、I've ever been. <laughs> 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 All right. So I know there's a spot where we missed a level.、Uh, back.、I'm、trying to remember how to get the fastest way to basically to get it. Because I have to have a Yoshi to get to, to the secret passage. 
I wish once you've found the secret passage, the it wouldn't still be glowing red. Yeah, that would be helpful. <laughs> and we're gonna use our cheat zone just a little bit, but you know. It's also a not terrible way to farm lives, just go into that repeatedly, once because once you have a Yoshi, that middle one drops a one up. Yeah, that's really slow though. Is that how you farmed like a hundred lives for each of us? No, I did that on this level, I think it was. Oh, I'm in the wrong spot. Uh, one of those two levels, there's a section where you, there's a checkpoint and then there's immediately a star and like 20 or 30 enemies. So you just pick up the star, then you run. Huh. Hold on a second. That You're supposed to be playing right now. What? Oh wait, no, never mind. I was, I, I completely forgot that you just did play. I was like, oh. I, I, yeah. I, I, I caught the vibe. I was like, wait, I'm. I wasn't, uh, wasn't playing for long, but I played. <laughs> but you tried. And therefore, no one should criticize you. Like I said, I made it further than I've ever made it. Yeah, because there were no obstacles. You just had to jump on the platform and stay on the platform. <laughs> but I was enticed by the mushroom. And again, I think this level, like, I'm pretty sure you can beat it by just getting a running start and then jumping only on the saw blades with Yoshi. But Oh, you can do that? Yeah, but uh, I'm fairly sure, certain you can do that. But I lack the confidence to do it. Yeah, basically just Oh, you do don't even have to hit the top of it. No, just have to hit the spikes with your feet. With your Yoshi feet. Is it this level? Pretty sure it's this level. Yeah, this is the one that, because it's red and it didn't, we didn't have any of the other paths in left. I don't remember at all. Yeah. So you're trying to find the secret? Yep. Oh. That's cool. Yeah, it's kind of a neat little, like the way it they, they tells you with the sign behind the the ticker uh -huh. tape. Uh, it's a neat little, little area. But since we're going for 100% completion here, I figured I might as well drop back and pick up this one. Yeah, makes sense. All righty. You get to play Way Cool. That's the name of the level. That's the name of this level? Mm-hmm. So, in case you hadn't figured out, hitting the switches switches the track. I would advise... I actually don't Switches from I think, I th like where that's a coin. I can't... Uh, I should have just stayed down. <laughs> It just switches the, the line so that uh, it goes to a different track. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Soda Lake is this one. I hate, I hate the underwater levels. What was this? Have Soda we? Lake? Soda Lake. Well, it's donut. The donut world. So, uh, right? Chocolate. Not donut. Chocolate. Uh, friggin' whatever. It's a bunch of stuff named after a bunch of sweets. And I can't go down anywhere. You can drop it after that yeah, one. I can right there. There we go. You picked the narrowest gap to drop through. And then I immediately suffered for it. Well, I did the gap fine. It was afterwards. Uh, yeah. And I think this one... Nope. <laughs> I was, I was that looks like a Mickey Mouse hand that drops it. <laughs> it is a Mickey Mouse hand. Yeah, that little white glove. Black, black line arm, white glove with the three black line knuckles. Knuc not knuckles, uh... Veins. I guess tendon indentations? I don't know what you would call that. Nope. Nice. Couldn't draw fast enough. Should I should have just shot up, but oh well, that's fine. Ugh, I have plenty right. of lives to play with. Oh yeah, way cool, I see that. <laughs> Ugh, I'm just gonna go as is, I guess. Because I don't really... Yeah, you think, I mean, you've died every yeah. time you've gone middle, so you might as well try a different route. <laughs> ah, well, I, I I don't know why I was looking just, down. Just watching him. I was I was watching the two in the middle. <laughs> like, yeah, how would I jump through in case that? They jump, they jump down and get you. Ugh, that was the dumbest. <laughs> that was probably the dumbest I've ever died. <laughs> I'm sure you'll top yourself later. Eh, we'll see. That that was pretty bad. Hopefully, I won't ever top myself. Goodness gracious. Pixel perfect. Aww. It was almost really pretty. Um, I hate the underwater levels in this game. I don't remember if it was in this game or if it was a, in a different game where you were talking about watching the Nintendo Direct for the new Mario game. Like, what was it called? Mario Wonder? Super Mario Bros. Wonder. 
It looks interesting. One, yeah, it's, it's wonder with an O, not an A. Um, but it, it definitely looks I lo different. I love that it has a different art style. That may, that brings me much joy because yeah, it, I was getting tired of the three the same three D look that all the games, the recent games have been having. Right, and Nintendo doesn't like to modify recipes. But the characters still look. Oh yeah, they definitely the same ish. Still, it's definitely still Mario, definitely still Peach, and all them. But yeah, it looks really great. It looks like they're doing some weird, wacky things, which is exactly what Nintendo should be doing. They should always be doing the weird and wacky. Um, we've talked very, 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 very briefly about <sighs> Pikmin. Get in front of it. Yep. Um. Yeah, I am stoked. And like for I Pikmin said, 4. I don't know anything about Pikmin, but I, what is it? Pikmin Four. Yep. Four it's coming out. Yep, and you, it, they did the th they did what Sonic Forces or they're doing what Sonic Forces did, where you get to self insert your own uh, head can because you get to make your own character. <laughs> this is the first time the franchise let you do that. Huh? What is the what is the whole like? Is it a platformer? Uh, Oof. not really. It's it's more like an RTS, like a real time strategy. Uh, you basically have. Well, I, I think that was the right decision. Um, you basically have. Pikmin. I couldn't. Mm. These tiny little plant things, and they're kind of a mix of plants and animals. Uh huh. And you got to cultivate them, so you've got to basically you've got to grow them. And then, uh, like red Pikmin are fire resistant to fire, so you can put out fires and attack fire enemies and stuff. And uh, you basically. See, that's backwards to me. I would think you would want to put out fires and attack fire creatures with a blue one. Well, I think blue's electricity. If I oh, that's so backwards. Why isn't it yellow? Um, nope, it is yellow. Yellow is. It's been a long time since I played Pikmin. I've only ever played Pikmin 1. Um, and that's just because I didn't have it. Just didn't have the game. So. What was that on the Wii? Uh, that was GameCube. Oh, okay. There, 3 was on the Wii, I th or the Wii U, I think. And then, uh, then they remade... They just they announced the re or they released the I think they released I don't remember if they announced or they released but uh, one and two were remade for the Switch and uh, and obviously the new one coming out so yeah my whole uh, exposure to Pikmin is from Super Mario Bros mm -hmm. so I guess that first came out in Brawl like Smash? what Super did I say Super Mario Bros I meant Super Smash Bros <laughs> uh, was it Brawl where Olimar was first introduced. Uh, as a playable character, yeah. Yeah, he was in Brawl. Okay, but he was, a, what, a trophy earlier? Or not trophy. Yeah, yeah trophy. Yeah, he was just a trophy. Yeah, as a playable character, he was, Brawl was his first appearance. Um, and there, Soda Lake takes you to the Star Road. Isn't that exciting? Cool. So I've completed the overworld now. Oh, it's like done-done? Yep. Well, everything except Bowser. And how many more star levels are there after I do uh, this run? After you finish, you have six left, so this and five more. Good grief. <laughs> that was... Eh. <laughs> that's that's kind of weird, because you got to jump over it when he loops down. Yeah, the time... But then immediately jump back away from it. The timing's a little, little weird. Now, here's the question. Is, do you want assistance? Um, or do you just want me to play the other star levels? You do whatever you want to do. I'm just going to play the other star levels. Okay. And I'll see if I can pass you before you get there. <laughs> oh. I thought you were talking about going ahead to the other five. No. How do you get to the other five? Uh, you, you unlock them. Uh, as, once you beat that level, it'll, it'll move you to the next one. Okay. Um, I hope it takes you four episodes to beat the... <laughs> The other one, the the, the pal balloon one. I hate that level so much. I do too. That's how we do nice. it. Nice. Now the question is, can I do this without dying? <laughs> of course not. Mm -mm. Of course not. Had to take that little bit of damage. This is the hard part right here. Uh, I don't remember. Love the music in this game. I'm gonna be really mad. I'm gonna be really mad. Oh no, Get I'm mad. mad. Get mad, die tired. Uh. Well. Oh, and I get the bonus. And you stage. get the mini game. 
Yay! I do wish, like, they brought back the bon end of, like, the ticker tape end of level bonus games, because they're fun and goofy. Brought them back to what? Like, the new ones? Yeah, the new Marios. Uh, Maybe. I did recently start playing through uh, New Luigi U on the Switch, which is the Wii U New Super Mario Brothers, because I love the New Super Mario Brothers games, uh, especially like the original on the Wii, not the original on the 3DS, because I didn't have a 3DS until I was an adult, and so I didn't get, I didn't actually get that one, but um, I tried to just stay on the very back of the panel. Yeah, I just need fine. to, I need to go straight up. Either get on the very front or the very back of the panel, and you'll be good. <sighs> I don't like this level. I'm doing this for you. Trust me, I you don't you don't need to do it for me. <laughs> if you beat Bowser, does the game stop or does it let you keep going? Uh, it lets you. It takes you back to the the main world. Uh, new game plus. That's it. Game over. Uh, Good. I'm of. glad you didn't get that on your first try. <laughs> All right. The pal balloon's just Gotta not fun. Ahead. Like, it slows no. you down so much. You have very little control. It's just not fun. And, like... Excuse me. On the, um... When you first get it, it sends you so far down. <laughs> nope. I should stay on the back. Hmm. I should stay on the very, very back. I wonder if the pathing... If it, 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 because it was faster that time. Uh, but I wonder if the pathing is was messed up because of the, because uh, you were staying on the front, so the guy spawned in sooner. Mm hmm. Yeah, maybe. Let's do this. We're going this way. Don't remember if there's a balloon in there, but we're gonna. Oh, you jerk. Yeah, they're annoying. Mm hmm. All right, I'm gonna get past that one guy. <laughs> I'm going in this to get past him. On this this one right here, this is it. I'm gonna get past the guy. Made it past him before. It's easy. It's easy. I don't know why easy I'm peasy. just not doing it. You're just stressing. You just gotta do it. All right. See, he just spawned in. Yeah. See. See, it's hit easy. It, it. Okay. Just gotta hit it, do hit it. it. Hit, I'm hit it. that one. Yeah. Because otherwise, it puts you on the loop, and you go all the way back to the beginning. Easy. Easy. If you. Sp Spin, I believe you can bounce off those even as young as baby Mario. Well, I don't really want to try. Oh, whoa. <laughs> I was getting ready to just full send. I wonder if I can go down here. Nope. Nope. I'm doing this one different. I'm using my um, D pad. I'm using the, the Joy Cons. What the heck? It's a Yoshi thing. Oh. What? You gotta hold up, otherwise you won't. I did. Well, apparently, game disagrees. Well, I disagree. <laughs> the um, I'm using the Joy Cons and I'm using the 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 four buttons on the left one instead of the control stick. Mm -hmm. And it's it's definitely different. I don't know if I'm doing better or worse. Only time will tell. Oh, come I on. hate the balloon so much. Yeah, that was a that was just a bad move. I feel stupid. Are you are you purposely sandbagging so that you no, make me feel not. better? Of course not. Would I lie to you? Sometimes. When if it was if it was for my own good. When it was thematically appropriate, sure. Uh, in this context, Aha. no, I would not lie to you. Uh, so what's new with me? I got a new 3D printer, and as you know, because I've been putting pictures in the Discord, or the, not the Discord, the group me, the group me, and uh, it freaking is a workhorse. Like I, I bought it because they just introduced the M5 line. It's I got the Anycubic Photon Mono X2 because it was on sale, so I ended up paying 230 bucks for it, which is. Uh, Way less than originally MSRPs, uh, but they, Anycubic just launched their new line. So, oh, I've, uh, I he, I got under I got over him. I should have just stayed <laughs> with it. But I love it. It's, it's working great. It's a great printer. Uh, I will say, working with resin, because somebody asked me 
a few days ago. I think it was me. Uh, I think it was actually Greg. Um, yeah, it was Greg. Uh, would I recommend a beginner start with resin or filament? Because you and I talked about resin and filament right. when we recorded last. Right. Um, but I definitely would not recommend a resin printer for a, for a first time printer. Uh, they are difficult to work with. I don't remember if there's anybody here or a thingy there, but there probably is. And now I'm going to die, but that's fine. Um, How did you nope. not? Nope, I'm dead. <laughs> Didn't get down fast enough. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, how they, many minis? You've sorry. printed like 10 minis now? I have printed 24 minis Good in the past three days. Grief. Because with I originally had the original Anycubic Photon, which has a pretty small build plate, pretty slow printer. It's pretty old. And uh, so I went from a cure time of 12 seconds per layer to a cure time of two seconds per layer with the, the, the X2. Wait, that was the one. Yep, that was the one. Now you get to do it again. Uh, so, and it's a larger build plate, so I can, I can do eight to 10 at a time. I have to go all the way back? Yeah. You fool. You shouldn't have made the mistake, obviously. Don't let that guy get you. <laughs> he Ooh. almost got you too. <laughs> <laughs> but he didn't. But, uh. This is a long. In addition to being faster, it's also a 4K printer, whereas the original was just an HD. So it's a, four, it's a much, much higher quality print. I, I have yet to have a single failure on the printer. Like, there's they come out looking be beautiful, need very little work to get them ready. Problem is now I've got a gray army, which is a, a crap load of minis that need to be painted. So, not looking forward to that. Because I don't... I like painting, but I don't like it whenever it's a chore. And whenever you've got, you know, 30 new figures to paint, it's a bit of a chore. Yeah, we, we're going to have to talk to Greg about having a paint party and... Mm -hmm. Get our other friend Zach to come hang out. Mm -hmm. it, I've only ever painted one mini, and it's a lot of fun. But I definitely don't want to like buy a paint kit <laughs> and then find out you hate it. Oh, I thought I got over it. Um, no, like, well, I mean, how many minis am I going to be painting? I've got. Right. I own like two. <laughs> uh, well, I just print another one for you. So. Well, I'm, uh, I'm including that one. Gotcha. So I, I subscribe. I, I mean, I DM, so I like having the minis. I also just really like the hobby of 3D printing. Uh, but I have, I'm subscribed to... How did you do that? Skills. Uh, I wish I could tell you. Uh, I'm subscribed to a, like, membership-based 3D model, 3D model thing. Uh -huh. So I pay like 15 bucks a month. Uh, it's called Loot. Loot Studios. Uh, and uh, I get pretty much all the... Come on. Yeah, boy. Ooh. Nope, not what I wanted. Keep going. Keep going. Uh, get pretty much all the minis I could possibly ever... My heart could ever want. There we go. Not bad. And, and it only uh, took one episode. There we go. Uh... But I, so I do a lot of printing. I also have like some bigger ones from Lord of the Print, just for my monsters and stuff. Lord so. of the Print? Lord of the Print. They do a lot of really cool monsters. Huh. All right, let's go. This is probably going to be the last one before we got to call it. All right, you got the clock, so I, yeah. I have no idea what the time is. We're at uh, time. 23 minutes. Here's where I start a really long convoluted story that ends on a cliffhanger. That way people are incentivized to watch the next episode. Like, these are my complaints about Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> and then spend 16 minutes, like... Bashing it. Just No, spend 16 it. minutes, like, getting distracted by other stuff like we did on Link to the Past. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, uh, well, I forgot that was coming. Uh, give us an outro. Uh, I don't know. Are, well, we on time? are we doing an outro or are we going one more? Huh? Are we doing an outro or go... I, you got the clock. I don't know yeah, what we, we need. We need, to, we need to call that right there. All right, go for it. Uh, well, thank you guys for watching. Um, tune in next time to see Zach pass me and continue on while I'm still stuck on this one level. <laughs> Bye.